Hey everybody, it's Alex from Red Sign, and we are here today at the Figurama Collector's booth and we're looking at the Helsing Alicad. So we saw this piece last year and it was like a bigger scale piece. They decided they need to revise it, uh, make it smaller. We then saw the unpainted version in Thailand at the Tokyo Ghoul unveiling and now we're seeing the painted version for the first time um, here now. So what we'll do is we'll run over the piece and we'll I'll let you know what we think about it. So keep watching. All right, so we're back. What we're gonna do then is we're gonna look at the piece, we're gonna go through, we're gonna do some close-ups and uh, I'll let you know what uh, any kind of um, revisions they're gonna make and any kind of changes that are gonna come up. So what we do then is, yeah, let's go straight into the piece. So what I'll do, I'm going to have to pick up the camera and uh, move it along. So, just get close in here. So, here you go. So here is the Alicad. This is the first time you see the new face. I'm trying to try and get in there to see the face. There you go really really well painted in Thailand this was a real nightmare put together there was 67 bats on his cape and uh, we had to glue them individually uh, put the bodies and the wings together and it took ages now this is much easier to assemble uh, it's been engineered so this is kind of how you're going to get it the one thing I've just been told is on his left hand on the gun it will be engraved in the same way as the other gun but this version hasn't got it at the moment at the con, but when people get it in hand, they will get that. So yeah, and what we'll do, just go up and down. Love that one, that's my favorite part of it. This guy here is definitely not having a good day. Yeah, amazing. Eyeball popping out. Wow. I think last time I counted, there were like over 10, um, 10 guards on the actual base here. They're kind of all over the place, all totally different. You know, some of them with their faces and some of them with um, kind of masks on. And you can see there as well, that guy. <laughs> wow. And then the guy in the back there with a the gas mask on. Really cool. What I might do is I might go freehand in a second and I might kind of pick it up without everything attached to it. Damn. The detailing on these guards are crazy. I mean, this price of this piece, I think was about $850 for a 400 edition size. And I, I've been speaking to quite a lot of uh, statue producers in my time and I honestly don't know how they're making any money on this because them, them kind of numbers just you know the profit is going to be crazy um, crazy low I mean and I don't even know if they're going to break even with this it. it's, it's insane um, what I'm going to do then is I'm going to kind of give it a little bit of up and down if I can unlock this and All right, so we're going freehand here. I'm, I'm sorry if it's a bit shaky. Uh, a lot of people walking around, a lot of people waiting for me to finish. So I'm going to make them wait. Yeah, that's definitely my favorite piece. Damn, love that. And it is also, I get told off for touching stuff, but I am allowed here. That comes off here, uh, there. I'm quite surprised they didn't, um, one of the things, I mean, it's very minor, but they could have used their clear resin on that, but, you know, I, I, think, I think it still looks fantastic. Uh, what we'll try and do, 
see if I can get up high and see if I can get in there for the uh, bats. And then the, uh, yeah, the base, this thing is insane. Again, I mean, um, at $850, whoever bought this, that's, that's a steal. I mean, if you were to order this, if this got pre-ordered today, this is going to be like $1,250. This, this, I don't, I don't even know how they've, because also originally it was going to be bigger as well. I don't, I don't know how that's a, a possible price to do. I'm, I'm baffled. Um, but yeah, phenomenal, phenomenal piece. So yeah, sorry, sorry about my rambling. <laughs> there you go. Helsing, Alakad by Figurama Collectors. Thanks, people.